Committee of the Regions brings together in the Vesta Gasfabriek all the different levels, all the different players who will bring the urban agenda forward. Talk about all the possibilities of the EU urban agenda. How we and how the different cities can make new things to happen for the benefit of the people. For me, the answer lies in one word, partnership. The urban agenda can only be effective with the implementation focuses on the needs and concerns of our citizens. Europe's sovereignty derives from citizens, not from the top down. Cities need to say, let's include Europe. Europe doesn't need to say, let's include cities. Knowledge-driven economy is probably the best type of economy that we can thrive on in a globalizing economy. Oggi l'innovazione nasce dal basso, non è più il frutto delle politiche degli stati nazionali, ma è la conseguenza della capacità delle città e delle regioni di creare un contesto in cui l'innovazione possa nascere e crescere. The concept of having the policymakers, the politicians, the civil society, local businesses and innovators around the same table finding common solutions, we think that this will multiply the individual effects and will help to create more livable and greener cities. Challenges like unemployment, aging population, migration make it increasingly difficult for cities to maintain an adequate level of social inclusion. The development of the EU depends on the dynamism and mobilisation of all its constituent parts, both urban and rural. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have a fair warm applause for the Pact of Amsterdam? Thank you. So in this pact we say, in policy making, cities should be at the start of the chain. The EU Urban Agenda will further support cities to better do their job and help us better do our job. I think if we really want to store credibility in Europe, then we have the next decades to work on agenda for citizens.